verbal abuse, physical abuse, the fear of being thrown out onto the streets and the need to be accepted by society. These are just some of the issues that have been raised in our film, In Solidarity, The Migration Blanket. My name is Salma Zulfikar. I'm an artist, an activist, and a filmmaker. Last year, I took my project Art Connects online to be able to reach out to vulnerable girls and women, refugees, asylum seekers around the world. We managed to be able to connect with girls in refugee camps, in orphanages, and in other temporary accommodation. People were suffering in silence. As many of the women and girls were living in temporary accommodation, they weren't able to social distance properly. And this meant that some of them actually contracted the virus. Luckily, they're okay, but it's meant that it's had a really big impact on their mental health. And one of the things that we try to do in the project is be able to support them with this. Being in isolation, being in lockdown itself posed a lot of different challenges for everyone when it came to mental health but being in their situation made it even worse. This has left them feeling even more vulnerable than they already are. So the project helped them to express themselves creatively, create drawings that were put together into the film and showed and highlighted their needs and their feelings and also um, help them express themselves when it comes to um, the pandemic because their voices have been largely unheard. So the film really gives them a platform to be able to showcase not only their artwork, but have their voice heard. The film also is a call for solidarity. It's a, it's a call for people to have more compassion and it's a call for people to reach out and um, support the most vulnerable people on our planet. We have faced a situation over the past year which has been devastating for everyone. And women and girls are always the most um, affected in these kind of situations. Um, people who have no proper home, um, they don't have any support, they're financially restricted, they don't have the money to even feed themselves properly, are suffering in, in a big way. And this film really is about them and about showing the world and the international aid community what their needs are. We really hope that people watching the film, policymakers in particular, will be more inclined and will be influenced to create policies that are humane, that take into account that these people are human beings. They're not political pawns, they are not there to be abused, and they are certainly not there to be discounted in a global pandemic. So we really hope this film has an impact in showing the world that people have something to contribute. Women and girls, asylum seekers, refugees are very much part of our community. They contribute to the global economy and have a lot to give. So we hope that people will also reach out and give back. Thank you.